Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. Tinubu's outburst on 25% spark fresh controversies as INEC meets NURTW, NARTO over rerun of election. Notice that this point, they carry election materials, road transport workers and the rest, and they carry materials from one point to the other. The Nigerians, some people say, we say, the election will not happen now. They say, truth, not the inside. They say, we'll not get where they tell us the truth. They say, most of the people are basically looking out for themselves. Say most of the people are basically, you know, searching and seeing what they can do for themselves. Say so, you know, you know they really talk the truth. They say because right about now, many more things they ground, you know, where go feel where people can look upon. Okay, they can look upon, and truth can be revealed. They say, but guess what? Yeah, they, they won't. They won't prepare themselves in case and in case. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Thank you. Tinubu's outburst on 25% spark fresh controversies as INEC meets NURTW, NARTO. The candidate of the All Progressive Congress, APC, in the 2023 presidential election and now president and commander in chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, stirs the honeycomb recently when he cautioned the presidential election petition court. PEPT against attempting to remove him from office because he did not get 25% of the total votes of the total votes cast during the presidential election in the Federal Capital Territory, FCT Abuja. He warned that such action could lead the country to a chaos and anarchy in the can result in the country asking the lecture, election tribunal to dismiss the petition citing the citing notification and all that has been going on he said the nullification of his presidential election will bring about unrest and unlawful unlawful activities we go on which will destroy the country rather than building it he says a lot of Nigerians have accepted it and they've moved on. 30 states of the Federation, there will be failure. They will be, they will be faulted by just one state because it's FCT. No way. I have come to stay. No one will take me out. Tinubu cont contested the February 25th presidential election on the platform of the APC and was abso absolutely the winner by the Independent National Electoral Commission's declaration we said the had 8 8.7 million votes to bear his to bear his closest sus subscriber to get his closest contender alaji atiku abubakar with 6.9 million votes and peter obi with 6.1 million votes the independent national electoral commission has commenced a review of its deployment of personnel and materials across the 2023 presidential election has gone forward now to ensure that they prepare adequately but also apologize to Nigerians on their failure on when they should have spoken and made things better and says it is time that Nigerians begin to act accordingly and lift up the country from where we currently is now where we ought to be so my wonderful people this is what is going on if you listen let's now nah, nah, yeah you know it's as if something has really really gone on and every single person needs to understand that there are different opinion mindset with regards to our nigerian society you know how does it come how do we how do we what do we uh, what do we do differently in order to ensure that these differences are felt so we don't continue in the same path and we don't uh, leave ourselves in despair every single person needs to rise up all hands on deck we you know we, what we've been saying for a long time we can actually stand today and nobody uh, you know so these are some of the things going on sinobu has said that you know if they remove him, there will be a problem. 
Many people asking, what problem will there be? Who to who and who will be causing the problem? Because everybody will be at home after rejoicing. If, for instance, their candidate is declared the winner, they will go home and, you know, relax. So who exactly is causing the problem? Is it your boys? If it is your boys, then they will have to fight alone you know, because nobody will fight with them. You get me now? Exactly. So what exactly is going on here? I just want to... I just want everybody to know that the possibility to change this nation is right within our grasp, and so we, can, we, are not, we cannot afford, okay, to to lose everything. That we cannot afford to do that. If we do that, it's like a man who took his gold coin and threw it into the sea, and expect that tomorrow when he comes back, you know, we just see it. The gold coin, you know, has a very good. Way. Kind of like on that, on that, on that, on that, you know, that's on, you know, so these are some of the things that are going on. Anyway, my lovely, wonderful people, remember that none of us should sit back there and think that, you know, things will, will just remain the way they are because we say so. At some point, we need to add to it. Please join a political party. That's the first place to start. They might just come, even if you go to the meeting, they just ask. What party are you? You see, so so it is. It's important. It's important for us to say, you know, uh, have, uh, you know. So Nigerians, they say the ball is in our court. The ball is in our court. What are we doing with it? Are we just going to toss it around, or are we going to be honestly, sincerely ready and prepared to pass it on, so that we can pass on the right button and the right speed under the right condition? all things being equal to the next generation. So it is very, very important that nobody circumvent our will, that we all are ready, we are sincere, and we are ready to go. Because when we do that, when we are ready to go, when we are ready to push and to ensure that we do everything necessary, needed and right, you'll be surprised how things will be. You'll be surprised how things will be. Yeah, so the difference will surely become clear. The vision will surely, be, you know, it will surely become very clear. So please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe, click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a lovely and a fantastic day. From us, it's bye for now.